Hey guys, 91 Extreme RT here with another episode of my Final Fantasy XIV Let's Play series. Right now, I have to go and do a Tolbert mission. Investigate the Life Men Stump. According to the quest giver, it is a covert operation, so that is what I'm going to go and check out. Oh, look at this cute little frog. These graphics are pretty good. Whoa. Oh, I'm supposed to go through here, evidently. How do I get there? Up and over. I don't know, but I gotta find my way up there somehow. Well, obviously that is not it. It says that's where I gotta go. But, obviously it's harder than that. Oh, would you look at that, right above. Yeah, if only it was that easy. Alright. Investigate the life men's stomach. Any unruly monsters around? You're about to enter an instance battle. Instant battles occur during certain quests and missions. Take a moment to read the information displayed in the active help window before answering the call of duty. Proceed. Ooh, instance battle. Let's check this shit out. God, look at this stupid looking gear I have on. I had to go to the tailor and get this random gear in order to get the quest even get to here. Because no, I had to have here. gear that was all like level 5 or higher. And this is all I could find. 1700s looking balloon pantaloons. Oh dear. Is that a sword in the stump? Bad idea. Really bad idea. Oh, what the hell? This chick it has voice a acting. Lot less than that to incite the green wrath, you know? Why, the first time we came to the Twelves Wood, Is we this almost our ended dark up as a strange tree. dinner just for crashing our airship no, no, in the wrong place. What? It was Hmm. You know him, Kubla Kong? Well, not exactly, but we did once share a carrot. Yada, yada, yada. Dude, I want to fight some people. Oh, yeah. I should mention that I tried choosing a different class by buying a different weapon for a different class. How and it said that I couldn't uh, have another class until level 10. Until I get my original class's uh, level 10 uh, quest done for my class. So once I get level 10, I'm going to try going to Mage Route and see how that is. And as I go, I'm going to try out different classes and just see how it all works. Because you, you can level up every single class in the game with one single character. You can do everything with one character instead of having one character for healing, one for tanking. Uh, or et cetera, et cetera, having one character with this crafting and one character with that gathering uh, profession. You can have everything at one single character if you want to invest the time into it, so. 
the slightest disrupt and this sort of thing happened. Wow, look at this thing. That's a pissed off tree. I'm so hungry. <laughs> Green skin. <laughs> Look at these uglies. It seems we Ooh, fist weapons got me a monk on my hands. That's one big dude. You're gonna get debuffed and poisoned right off the bat, you fat fucker. Take one of them down at first. There we go. Juice. I need some mana potion. Bam, duty complete. Nice. Ooh, I'm almost level 8. I should be able to get some uh, new gear. I think at level 8 I get a new set of gear. Which would be phenomenal because I got junk right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Skip cutscene. Ain't got time for this. Ain't nobody got time for this. Especially this guy. Alright. Interacting. Pull a sword from the life men's stump. Delivered a sword to Galfrin. Alrighty then. Let's uh, sprint the hell on out of here. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that little instance battle. Um, let's see, I'm level 7, I'm almost level 8. Um, I, I was talking to my brother last night in game, and he says uh, you can start doing dungeons at level 15, so I'm going to have to work on getting there uh, this weekend probably. Not tomorrow, because uh, my best friend, uh, since I was like in preschool, so for like 25 years, um, he's getting married tomorrow, so I won't be on playing at all tomorrow. I will be posting a video, but, um, before I go to the wedding, uh, but I won't be working on any of my stuff at all, so. Ooh, what do I got? Magic Blade, hand over. Alright, give me a new bow. 
Give me something that I can actually kill something with. That doesn't take freaking 15 minutes. Yada yada yada. Hey, give me your bow. Look, look at this crap that I got. I got a Walgreens bow. You have like a Cabela's bow. Oh, pfft. gold experience. What do I need that crap for? I need gear. I need gear more than I need anything else. What other quest you got for me? Which is to collect his Chigoli egg sex. Sure. All right, let's go collect these egg sacks. See a whole bunch of them over here. AOE abilities, I can just shred these guys. I can just tab target a whole bunch of them, gather them, LOS them, get them all onto a nice pile behind a tree and just smash them. Look how much little damage I do to these guys. I'm almost three levels higher than these guys. Sure, I'm not taking much damage, but still. I should be able to kill stuff a little bit quicker. Ooh, my poison's eating away at you. The overgrown West Nile mosquito. What is that? That's definitely a West Nile mosquito. No, that's a level 9. Shit. He's a couple levels higher than me. <laughs> oh, shit. You get destroyed by my poison. You may be a West Nile mosquito, but I got something a bit more deadly for you. Bam! Here's a level 5. That'll do. At level 8, I get uh, a new ability. It's called a heavier shot. And it actually gives my uh, my next, I believe, straight shot. This one. Um, is it a straight shot? Or venomous bite? It gives one of them like an extra 20% chance to crit, which would be freaking awesome. Then I can start setting up an actual rotation. I mean, right now I set up my uh, critical hit rate buff uh, ability first, and then I put on my poison. Because um, that way, what, when the when it, when that one hits and the poison starts ticking, it already has a critical hit chance buff on it, and then my main spam. That's how I currently have it set up right now. But uh, next few levels here, I'll be able to get some abilities that are actually on cooldown that start being able to macro stuff because there is macros built into the game that you can do so kind of like rift or warcraft other games so all right got all this stuff done let's rush back here and hand this crap in get away from these malaria ridden mosquitoes all righty here's your egg sacks Complete wind shower, tiny crystalline manifest etheric wind energy. Nice. Not that I need it, but okay. All right. Ooh, level eight. Level eight. Heavier shot. Trait acquired. All right. Where do I go for that? I think it's P. Uh, let's see. Trait. Heavier shot. 
adds to heavy shot a 20% chance that your next straight shot will deal critical damage. Now, can I put that on my bars, or is it, auto, or is it passive? Are traits passive? I'm guessing they're passive. As the heavy shot, 20% chance that your next straight shot will deal critical damage. So what I'm going to do is start off, let's unlock that, start off with Venomous Bite, get the Venom on, and then I can go back and forth between heavy shot, straight shot, heavy shot, straight shot. So I can keep rebuffing my thing here. So let's uh, try this here, see if it gives me the buff up top. Not really noticing a difference. No. Trait. Heavier shot. Straighter shot. Huh. Straighter shot. Well. Actions. Heavy shot range and straight shot venomous. Ooh, misery's end. What is that? Delivers an attack with a potency of 190. Can only be executed when the target's HP is below 20%. So I'm actually going to macro that in. Ooh, shut up, phone. I'm actually going to macro that in with Heavy Shot. Nice. Misery's End. Okay, let's... Uh, main commands, hunting key achievements, action straight stance. Map part of my assigns you most for waymarks. Way marks. Way marks, what's that? Place markers to guide your party members to a destination. Huh. Well, I guess I found what I was looking for before. Wow, there's a lot of stuff here. User macros. Here we go. Name. 1v1. Let's see. I don't know how their macro system works, but I'm assuming it's cast, forward slash cast. Let's go back to actions, forward slash cast, miseries, and cast, heavy shot. Oops, heavy shot. just all that crap. Alright. 1v1. Can I pick a picture for it? Ooh, sure can. Hmm. One. Let's see if this macro works. Misery does not exist. Huh. Slash kill? How can I... Eh. Let's see here. Let's go back to... Where the hell was that? Character duty... Social party travel logs duty. Hmm. Oh yeah, it was under here. 
big man. It's ready check. Exit game. Keep on user macros. Oh, I clicked on you. There we go. Is it by chance? Cast Misery's End? Cast Heavy Shot? Let's find out here. You must wait for using say yeah I'll shut again. What? Come on. Main command. Okay. Alright, I'm putting that there just so I can click on it. Lock the taskbar. Click on that. Execute. Let's execute. Use. Let's see here. All right. Well, I'm gonna go figure this out. So the next video that I'm going to be posting will be a macro video on how to do attack macro specifically. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you later.